he's highly skilled. Michael Jordan, MJ. It really doesn't get much better than this. Michael Jordan's flair, charisma, control, understanding the game. Nobody can do that. He was so graceful with the basketball and uh, he would change gears on you and change the uh, uh, direction really, really quick. It's, it's just amazing, man. If you see it, you know, in person, it's like, we're like, oh, uh, you know, we start a fast break, uh-oh, somebody's gonna get dunked on. And it's gonna be Michael dunking on somebody. <laughs> In the 1990 Eastern Conference Finals, I think the Bulls was really getting to figure us, us out. Joe Dumas used to guard him first because that's the beginning of the game. Then once he got out the game, I had to go guard him. You know, I don't think anybody else could have guarded him. John Sally, Rick Mahorn, Bill Lambeer, no. <laughs> Whenever he got the ball, I'm pretty much like no one should knows with him because I didn't want him to do anything to embarrass me. I'm gonna name the Jordan rule. If he goes to the hole, put him on the ground. If you see some of those clips, you'll see that we just hit them every time we go to the basket. And he's always on the ground, you know, like in pain. But he always gets back up. So he learned after a while, man, that he just started, he just took control from there. I think people really saw the, one of the best performance in the, in, in the NBA when Michael played against us. And we didn't let anyone do that against us. We almost put 50 on us quick. Check his resume out. It's awesome. It's like, wow, this guy is amazing. The L traversing away from the iconic Chicago skyline and the Sears Tower. It's our backdrop for postseason basketball. It's the this Eastern Conference Bulls. Final. Game three this between the Pistons and the Bulls. Hi, everyone. Kevin Harlan joined by coach Eastern Mike Fratello and Clark Kellogg. It's physical. You know you'll get bumped and banged. So they're really trying to cut him down with a lot of bodies and a lot of physicality. And so far, through the first two ball movement. For three, Paxson. Here's Grant. Banked in off the... And that is something they're going to have to avoid here. Without question, 19 turnovers for them last game. You know the Pistons bring the pressure. Bulls have to dare him to prove he can make it from that spot. Unfortunately for him, not able there. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls will retain possession. Grant positioning himself perfectly to get the block. They did both ends using a combination of physicality and skill. A nice blend. Now here's Rodman. Back to Thomas. That drops and it comes off the assist from Rodman. And passes to Pippen. And here's Jordan outside. Good on the triple. Jordan often gets his hoops off the dribble, but he... The 15-footer uses the glass Joe that time, and it's good. Bulls trail by 12. Coach, a tough stretch for this offense. I'd say they need to get back to what they do best. Right now, that's a question mark. A big question mark. Armstrong against Thomas. Armstrong passes to King. And he goes up strong with one hand and flushes it down. And he's highly skilled. Michael Jordan, MJ. It really doesn't get much better than this. Outside Thomas. And Detroit again with the bucket. Here's Jordan. And it goes down two points. Here's Dumars. And Jordan sends it back. Boy, much respect for the defense of Jordan. I mean, he gives his all on this end of the floor. I mean, fantastic. Getting his hands up to block shots. Here's Dumars. That one falls, coming off of Thomas's feet. Well, I cannot believe he didn't capitalize there. And neither can he. Oh, and the jam by Jordan. Making the correct decision. Hodges with the assist. That shot is in, just like six others have been for him. He's shooting seven for 15. First half to a close. It's Detroit, up nine. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Tack the rim. They settled for way too many outside looks the first few games. You need to test the Pistons inside. Grant trying to break free. It's good, and the Pistons lead has got to just seven on the basket from Jordan. And it's Johnson in for Dumars. Pistons substitution. shot and the layup by Thomas. Thomas got five points in the quarter. Inside, Cartwright 
That drops and it comes off an assist from Jordan. Aguirre against Pippen. Sally kicks to Thomas. Knocks down the three ball. He doesn't get the second one. Bulls trail by 12. Here's Jordan. Lays it up and banks it in. Jordan's got 10 points here in the second half. A high post shot, and the shot goes in from McGuire. Isaiah Thomas has been on display for the Detroit Pistons, and his big game just keeps getting bigger. Here we go, the fourth quarter on the way in this crucial game three in the Eastern Conference Final. Coaches in this matchup. Obviously, the Pistons have a legend on their bench who has won a title, but the Bulls have Jordan shown well on the coach. Jack. Detroit, no good that time either. Well, the Bulls have fouled a lot more in this game. They let the Pistons kill them at the line. You can't let that happen late in games. Edwards inside. He's against King. Edwards can't hit. Incredible effort defensively. No easy buckets. And Jordan gets it to go. Boy, I tell you, this team has too much spirit and leadership to throw in the towel. Jordan against Dumars. Here's King. And it's good assisting on the play with Jordan. The pass to Rodman. Another shot. The feed to Lambeer. Bucket is good. Lambeer's got four this quarter. Shot clock at five. Back to Thomas. Plenty of space. Good, and it's Dumars picking up the assist. Assist from Dumars got his fourth Dumars. assist in this one. And it's been the same story's coach for the Chicago Bulls. Turnovers just killing their chances. Incredible. And you wonder if they'll be able to get a game off the Pistons at this rate. Bulls continually giving their chances. Mm, frustrating. Aguayas checked in for Detroit. Substitution. Now here's Jordan. Outside for Pippen. Tries a three. Rebounded by Lambeer. Pistons leading by four. Thomas up top. Guarded by Paxson. Lambeer's shot is off. Always rough to miss a layup like that. The defense bothered him for sure. And it's in there. Uh, and Scotty Pippen so good at surveying the floor. Passes it to Doom. Poke loose and stolen by Jordan. Here's Pippen. Whistle blows. Basket is good. So a chance here for a three-point play. You have to finish plays like that. You can't look for the whistle against Detroit. First personal foul. Fifth team foul. And the free throw is good. Now leading by one. So it's Detroit now. Time called here. The Pistons decide to talk it over. They're sending guys to the foul line way more than they should. You'd like to see better positioning defensively. You got to do your work early so you're not in position to foul. Outside Dumars. Pass to Edwards. Outside Aguirre. It's Thomas on the wing. Just four to shoot. Using his quickness on the interior. That's Thomas' advantage. Third personal foul. And he makes the first. At the line for the Pistons, Isaiah. And he makes both free throws. Unfazed by the moment. He delivers when his team needs it the most. Chicago trailing here. Outside Jordan. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. 157 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Hey, anytime the game's on the line, Jordan is exactly the guy I wanted to strike. Personal foul. The team is in the penalty. At the line for Chicago. Drops the first one and ties the game up. So making both free throws, that'll give them the lead. Needed those and got them.
Thomas dishes to Edwards. Thomas passes to Edwards. A second chance effort feeds to Lambier. Good. And the Pistons lead by one. You hear about his physical toughness, but how about the mental toughness by Bill Lambier to take and make that big shot? Jordan passes the coach. And the jam by Bill Cartwright. Boy, they've managed to fight their way back into this one. This goes to show you, you can never give up. Stay with it, and good things can happen. And against some pretty tough odds. It wasn't easy for them to find their footing, but now they're rolling. And here's Jordan. He'll bring it out for the Bulls. Out to the wing. For three, Paxson. Rebounded by the Pistons. Liam Beers got his 16th rebound on the night. McGuire passes to Edwards. Thomas against Paxson. A 15-footer. Thomas's shot is off. And they've been moving the ballpark really well tonight. Good things come to those who take good shots. Here's Jordan. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. As a defender, he had to stay attached to Jordan. But here, he notices him playing tight. Good on the first, and that will put them up by two. So both free throws are good. And it's a three-point game. 40 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Paxson against Thomas. Over Paxson. And that one goes long. Well, it's been a turbulent quarter. Really rough for him. Nothing going his way. And he seems determined to shoot his way out of it. Jordan on the wing. It counts. This one's close to being over. I think if they get a couple stops, this game is toast. Now a timeout called by Detroit. They're trailing by five. 15 seconds left in the fourth quarter. What's your take, guys? Hey, the strategy is simple. Get a quick score and foul right away. That's got to be their mindset. And they'll have to execute perfectly here. Here's Thomas. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Heartbreak. Second personal foul. First free throw foul. is good, and that shrinks the margin to just Easy four. For Detroit. Game in the balance. This team wants Isaiah Thomas at the line. Fruitful trip to the line there. He's made this a one-possession game now. They foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. Hey, that's the right play. It's the smart play. you got to stop the clock. That's the hoping for a missed free throw or two. Every point is crucial here. Two shots. So the first one drops, and that gives them a four-point cushion. Second one is good. Bring both at the line, and it's a five-point game. Looking so composed at the free throw line. Not rushing anything, just going up there and getting the job done. Is it just me, or has this guy grabbed every rebound tonight? What a terrific performance. Pure effort out there. He is fighting, clawing, just willing himself to get everything. Mike in a game they needed to win so badly. Michael Jordan and the Bulls get the win. What a tremendous effort from Chicago. Series now moves to 2-1, and the Bulls are very much in it. This team showed a lot of metal fighting for the looks they got, converted when they needed to. And for the Pistons, Clark Bell.